I truly believe in terms of value, it's 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 an internal thing. Mm. If you're going to externalize your own personal value, mm. are you going to sink so far deep into darkness and in Flabini? Because yeah. people will always communicate with you at most mm. from a place of projecting yes. a negativity. Yes. Right? That a shortcoming so in themselves. So people will look <clears> at <throat> Dineo with like three children mm. from three different men. Mm. And they have no children. Yeah. And they feel like, but I'm in a better position. Why is she so confident? She yeah. should never be this confident. Yeah, absolutely. Hi, Aninga. And it's, but, but you're projecting your insecurity, my nana. Absolutely. You understand? Yeah. So you have to actually <clears throat> place a lot of value internally on yourself. Absolutely. How much work have you done to maintain your personal value? Because, I mean, publicly, we've seen you yeah. go through the most. Yeah. That season of your life, you Absolute. know which one I'm talking yes, yes, about. Yes, yes, yes. And you were there. So, I was, I was. Um, yeah. Look, I've done a lot of work. It, it takes a lot of work to learn to love yourself, to learn to love yourself again. Like, even the darkest corners of who you are. Yeah. It takes a lot of work, and it's an everyday thing. Like, you have to remind yourself. Mm-hmm. And I realized that. The moment that you do that, you attract that as well. You know what I mean? Like yeah. the people that are in your circle are people that love you and they care for you and want the best for you. Um, so, yeah, I mean, I think just also keeping my circle small as I possibly can. I think that's healthy. Yeah. That's healthy. Yeah. Speaking of positive <laughs> things now, I mean, you killed it on Kings of Joburg. Has it always been your thing to want to act? And can we expect any more acting gigs from you? Um, actually, I did. I, I had gone to VITS to study uh, my wow. BADA, but I didn't finish. Uh, funding, family, <laughs> money, you know, background. Um, mm. But but I've always had a passion for, <clears throat> for acting. And uh, yeah, I'd like to pursue more acting roles. Um, I also just, for me, I wanted to establish myself as CC the artist so that I'm not yes. called Kaya. Yeah, um, because I played her for so long that you know I cannot break out of that character yeah. even when I step into my musical role. So yeah, I definitely am at the point where I feel like I can do more acting. So to her mother, she is Busi Swatwala, but to you and I, she's simply Cece. She's also simply beautiful, talented. She's a superwoman. Cece, a multi award winning singer, mother, actress, a wife, <laughs> and also a brilliant dancer. Thank you. And like you and have a Busi hectic... Busi Siwe. Busi Siwe. Ah. Busi Siwe. Busi Siwe. Busi Siwe. Thank you very much. Point of correction, the leader. I order, order. Oh, you're over. <laughs> correction taken. Correction taken. Kedra, correction taken. So you are like literally a brilliant dancer. Number one. Number yeah. two, you have a wild sense of humor. Yeah. How many people know this about you? Like you're a clown. Sissy is a clown. And uh, I don't think a lot of people, I mean, a lot of people when they meet me, they're like, oh my gosh, you're actually funny. So You're was, super funny. Yeah, wow. so was this time, there was this She's time, I, I was at Nadia and Akai's launch, yeah. and then I got into the lift with Casper and I said something. And I was like, you're actually funny. I just looked at you on your social media. And I thought, ah, you know, just not be pretty, okay, sharp. You know what I mean? No personality there, but... What the hell? Wow. The yeah. biggest personality. Yeah, but I mean, that's because you know me. It's it's insane. Offline. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, do you have any other talents we don't know about? No. You've seen them singing, ah. acting. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, she's in the studio with us. Her name is Cece. She's going absolutely nowhere. Starting her day on 959. It's Wednesday, the 17th of August. And we're still hanging out with Cece. Starting her day on 959. Businesswoman, actress, singer. Young gained or talented girl, right? So, Cece, obviously, um, you know, on a Start Your Day on 959, we hang out with a lot of musos, actors, actresses, and so forth, right? Oh. Um, and uh, the other day, we were hanging out with uh, Name Apps. Yes. And uh, he was dropping obviously a new song yeah, Which yeah, was yeah. pretty dope yeah. And he surprised all of us with yeah. that And yesterday we were supposed to hang out with Abdul Koza. Yeah. Unfortunately it didn't happen We're hoping it will happen yeah. um, w- Another time um, He's also coming up with new music You're a musician Yeah. Do you have any new music up your sleeve? No. You also hang out with Monewa, actually. Yeah. yeah. Coming back into Is the it? music scene. Yeah, yeah. no. Yeah, yeah. I've, actually, I've actually missed her because I think she's phenomenal. Right? Yeah, I think she's gifted. But I mean, I... The music journey, it, it is a journey. You know, you go through your ups and your downs, and you, I love it. I hate it so much. Yeah. So it's, you know what I mean. So I'm happy she's back. 
Yeah, and yeah. yourself, new music? Um, no music at the moment, but I am working on a show and it's with Donna and Donna Love Tour. Yes. yes. Um, and yeah, man, I think we really just want to take people into our world. Even the way that we've created the set, it's almost like a sanctuary of love. Oh, beautiful. But there's like these ups and downs of like a relationship. So we take people through that journey in in the show. Angisa bibi tegi eksen gangag. Bibi tegi and bibi tegi. Bibi tegi and bibi tegi. Bibi tegi and bibi tegi. What's that? That's why I never want to watch it. I never let you do stupid things. I never let you do stupid things. I never let you do stupid things. Oh, please, thank you. You're the kind of girl that I need in my life. I will support. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Also, Zulu songs, Jay. It's easy to very good at all. We are born and then I'm just CC yourself. It's 22 minutes after 7, so Sol did mention to you that Cece was giving us a dance lesson uh, just off air there. You can yeah. uh, go check it out. All of it. Be the first to see. Be the first to know. La Lela. You know when they say, what work do you do? No, no, no. We don't work. We hobby. We hobby every day. Wale. <laughs> go to our Instagram page at 959breakfast underscore. Cece, you're a businesswoman also, yeah. right outside of just the music. Yeah. I once received a beautiful arrangement of roses. Yeah. Um, from your, what do we call it? Is it a florist? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Um, so w- w- I'm actually one of the partners at a company called Amashe Florist. Mm. It's actually an, an existing company. So they came to us and they're like, no, you know, we need a strategy. We want, because they were about to close down. So okay. then I said, listen, let's, let's do an MOU. I come in as a partner. I help, you know, grow the business and... Yeah, 50-50. So they were about to shut down and you rose to the occasion. You understand? Ah, she rose. See what you did there? She sells roses. See what you did there? Soul and the punches. (laughs) Why though? Why did you decide the flower business? I mean, you could have gone into any other business or partnered with anyone else. Oh, you could have partnered with your husband on the sportif. Yes. Um... Sure, I yeah, I know. Uh, um, I, <laughs> the reason the reason why I I chose is also because it was a, as it was it was a female owned brand, and I think as women we don't support each other enough, and uh, so yeah, I felt that you know instead of just coming in temporarily, let let us make it actually something that creates longevity for myself as well as as an artist, mm-hmm. um, but also it's it's one of like the least. Like it's overlooked a lot because people think, what money can you make from? But when you do a feasibility study, it actually makes a lot of money. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I have to ask, as an artist, generally we don't, um, you know, in the entertainment industry, people don't see themselves as businesses. Yeah. But being married to somebody who is a business person, Mm. does that then drive you to want to be more entrepreneurial? Absolutely. I mean, I think just to... Also, I think for me, COVID was just like, yeah, I need to find something outside of what I do. And also with the flower business, there were a lot of funerals. And at that time, it was really at the peak. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. I was like, I can take advantage of a, a crisis and, and see a gap in the market mm-hmm. and, and actually... Mm-hmm. Yeah. So can I say it's... Transmitted. <laughs> it is, yes, it is. Yeah. Can I tell you, disease is not the only thing that's yeah, sexually transmitted. Is, yeah. Good so, habits, bad habits, yeah. languages, best sexually yeah, transmitted. Yeah, yeah. You can say so, that. So, yeah, yes. I, mean, I mean, I think my love for business is a, a sexually transmitted. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's good. Yeah. Matrimonially transmitted <laughs> as well. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Wow. Healthy to say that. 25 minutes after 7, CC, what is in store? Well, uh, uh, are you pulling a Rihanna on us? One minute you are a big pop star, then the next minute you are just selling roses and you are a multi-billionaire and no more music. No, 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 I'm not. I mean, I, I think it's it's just also just trying to find the balance between the business, CC, and the music. The music, CC. Yeah, so um, it's, it's really for me a growth because I understand that the kind of business that we are in has a shelf life. You know, mm-hmm. there's always yeah. new people, younger, more talented. Mm-hmm. Um, and so, while I'm still at my peak, I should be able to utilize my brand to build businesses outside of the business that is CC. Good, good, yeah. good. I like that. Yeah. I like that a lot. It is said that um, when in love and the love is good, mm-hmm. musicians give us nothing. <clears throat> but when there's heartbreak, 
They go a damn that, ham on us. That's what we want. Are we waiting for a heartbreak before we get a song out of you? Or no, 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 are we no, going to get something good? I mean, it's good? not even two years that I've dropped my album. Yeah, so. Pressure, pressure, pressure. <laughs> Come through. So, so, like I said, I think I'm just still trying to find the balance of running the business and, yeah. and, and making sure that none of what I'm doing is neglected. And I think doing the love tour is still part of me creating, like, like, Extension, extension of, of music. Yes, extension of music you. and not because sometimes people say drop, drop. Then you don't buy our songs and you forget the it and it's frustrating. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> so, yeah. so I think it's just like taking the material that I've already got and like creating um, like a different platform for it, for a different platform for people to consume it. Mm-hmm. Um, and I, and I and I think for me, I'm using also that to create a story. Uh, within a story because our music tells a story so the show for us is like creating that story of Utando, chaos, happily ever after Mm -hmm. and I mean then it's just also raising the question of does love always win and I think the people that will know will be the people that buy their tickets on Compute Tickets I think love does win yeah I think love Mm. does win especially in in regards of self love yeah Mm. Mm. is there anything musically that you still want to do that you haven't done or a collaboration for example would you do a piano song I actually am considering doing an Afro Yano song. So I love in the Afro Yano. Yeah. I love Afro Yano. Yeah. So yeah. in the beginning, I was like, ah, Geza Vuga. I was like, no, I don't like. I'm a piano. Then I, I started hearing artists that made it a musical thing. Saki. So like, yes. yes. And I was like, Amifaku, Saki. Mm-hmm. I was like, okay, you know, I can I can actually dabble into it because there's mm. a, a musicality and a longevity thing behind. Uh, I'm a piano so that I would definitely try an Afro piano song fantastic we're just about to let you go CC but before we do we say thank you thank you guys for so starting happy. your day on 959 you spoke of the show that you're doing with Donald where is it um, it's at Lyric Theatre on the 26th of August mm-hmm. um, and the tickets are available on Compute Ticket and the show is called CC and Donald Love Tour so it's the love tour with CC and Donald the love tour with CC and Donald Godspeed yeah. on everything we wish you all the best. Name by Lizak. Thank you so yes, much. Yes, yes. <laughs> Have a great day. Uh, check it out for the camera. Thank you for watching.